It's been a dominating season so far for Seska Moscow. The first team through to the playoffs and now heading to their seventh successive Final Four, beating Crosstown rivals Hinky Moscow Region in the playoffs. Losing three-time champion Kyle Hines and 2016 MVP Nondo De Colo to injury, it would have been easy for Seska to make excuses in the postseason. But with a roster packed full of firepower, the seven-time champions dispatched their local rivals with a 3-1 series victory. Led by 2014 EuroLeague MVP Sergio Rodriguez, Seska flexed their muscles, El Chacho providing the spark to help Othello Hunter and Corey Higgins catch fire as well. I think our, our confidence is higher now. We have been working very good in the whole season, and that's well, where we have to be to be ready. Anything can happen, and everybody else on the team has to step up and, and be ready to, to, to get the, the challenge. Things didn't go to plan for Seska in Istanbul last May. Hoping to defend their 2016 title, Dimitris Itoudis' men were undone by a Vasilis Spanoulis masterclass. With memories of that semi-final defeat still fresh, the Russians retaliated to roar to the top of the regular season standings. It doesn't matter what you, you did during the season, it doesn't matter if you finish first or, or eighth. Now they are 14 to, to fight for the, for the titles. We need to be ready and try to do everything to you know, win these two games. We fight adversities, we fight uh, obstacles, but uh, when we stuck to the, to the plan, we have a strong belief. It's everything over here, uh, this is where we practice all year. We learn to play out of the comfort zone, which is good. This is like, this is what it's all about, Final Four. You, you can't be in your comfort zone. In their way stand Real Madrid. With 16 titles between the two giants, this semi-final is set to be a true heavyweight bout. And Sesc are well aware as to how their opponents can pack a punch. We know uh, how, how difficult it is to stop uh, either Luca or Sergio Yu or a lot of players in Real Madrid who are very talented. But at the same time, we are uh, as a team try to limit them and make them don't feel comfortable doing the game. You, know, you got a, guy, a lot of guys you got to watch out for. You know, JC is that one guy called Hot Play that he comes on. You got to watch him because he can score he immediately points, buckets, everything so fast. So. When you step on that court, it's a different kind of energy, and that energy can either break you or make you. They've been irrepressible all season. Can Seska build on their imperious form to win another title in Belgrade?